Hi everyone, here's a video on how to wipe your Xbox if you're going to sell it. I um, had a look online and uh, there wasn't many videos so I thought I would make my own. So first thing to do is boot up your Xbox. Now no matter what screen you're in, if you double tap the home button, so that's the home button here, double tap that and it will bring up this little side menu here. Go down to settings hit into settings, all settings, and then if you go down to system, and then we go console info and updates, we hit in there, and then we go to reset console. So if we go to reset console, we have three options here. Reset and keep my games and apps, or reset and remove everything. That's the one we're gonna go for. Now that's going to remove all of our save games, all of our um, profile information and it's going to revert the Xbox completely to factory settings. So if you are selling it, the person who would then switch it on will get the welcome screen that you got when you first got your Xbox. So at the moment it's now going through and wiping all the settings. So we'll see how long this takes. It shouldn't be too long. The Xbox is still on but the screen is blank. That's it down there, just powering away. If you got yourself a PlayStation 4 Pro, then you probably will be selling your Xbox. That's why I'm doing mine. So here we go. It's just started to reboot itself now. Nothing's happening on the Xbox itself. The screen is starting to wake up. And there we go, preparing console. Or waiting for that to do. My experience with the Xbox One has been okay, but I found the whole interface clunky. Um, joining communities, playing online, sharing, it, it really did make me feel old. Um, so I've just gone back to PlayStation, um, got a PlayStation 4 Pro. It's just so much easier. It's uh, easy to log in, easy to find your friends, easy to play online. Um, the graphics look a bit sharper. Um, I don't know if that's just me though. Um, I prefer the PlayStation controller to the Xbox, although that said you can buy an Xbox style controller for PlayStation. I know a lot of people prefer that. Um, it's just a better experience overall. I think um, Xbox One is just confusing. Um, there's nothing really that the Xbox does over the PlayStation or the PlayStation does over the Xbox, so it is really personal preference. I mean, the Pro is a better machine, but the Xbox is not. Um, now, the Xbox One S is just slim, so it's telling me to hit the button A, which we're going to do. And then here we are. We're in a fresh setup, so... That is how you completely wipe your Xbox, get rid of all your settings, and that Xbox One down there will be getting sold soon, as uh, the reason why you see the cable into my controller is uh, just don't have time to play it anymore with the PlayStation 4 Pro. So, hope that video was useful. Um, if you have any problems, uh, put it in the comments, give us a like and uh, subscribe if you like other wipe videos and how to moves. Um, and thanks for watching. Cheers.